all right so this is my final part <laughs> the flat iron so um I've already started flat ironing my hair I always start in the back, like my little short hairs, my little baby hairs, and then um, it is a lot thicker, and so this is going to take some time, so I'm going to just show you a couple of pieces, and then I'll come back once I'm done and show you the final. Um, thanks for watching. Once again, if you haven't seen the intro, or my pre-poo or the blow dry. You can always find those links down below. So stay tuned and we'll see you later. Do I see length? Yes, especially in my veins. Spend today right. in the conversation in the mirror, face to face with somebody okay. less than and the best thing that I can say first uh, is that it's thick. It's unbelievably thick. And I'm hoping that by December all the snickness will come down to my ends too, but Hey, what's up YouTube? It's me, Camille Brandy. Hi! So this is my post wrap up of my uh, series on how I do my straightening regimen. As you can see, my hair is straight. Couple things to note is that I continue to use a brush for my tracing method. I just don't do well with a fine tooth comb. It's just what I do. I continue to use the Silk Elements um, olive oil heat protectant. Uh, my hair is just so light and fluffy and I love it and so there's that and um, for the last part if you notice I started dusting my ends um, during during the flat flat iron process so I just really wanted to just kind of give you a quick show um, I just feel like it is important that I personally remember that this is not my long hair journey um, this is not my long natural journey, but this is my healthy hair journey. This is my healthy natural journey, my natural hair journey. And so because of that, whilst I was straightening my hair and I started to look at my ends and they were so dry and so brittle and some of them were damaged and I said, you know what, even if I can't show length right now, that's okay with me. I'd rather my hair be full and it be healthy versus it being long and straggly. Nobody trying to have no straggly thin ends like I did. So, yes. 
So with all of that said, I am going to enjoy my straight hair because this is the last time I'm going to straighten my hair until the new year. At that time, I think I'll go ahead and think about cutting off some more of my heat damage, but I just really want my new look to come in a bit more. Um, if you see my bangs, I love them. Yes, so happy. All right, you guys, we'll talk to you later.